Uh, James Fritz, 271 Crutcher Road, Port Townsend, Washington. Um, I think you probably saw in the paper that the unemployment rate in Jefferson County is now over 11% climbing. Uh, gold is well above $1,500. Uh, silver hit $49 and backed off to $48. That's because confidence in the U.S. government is collapsing. Um, they're saying by the tourist season, uh, gas will be $5 a gallon, and they're predicting $6 a gallon by the end of next year. Uh, crime against property is skyrocketing in Jefferson County. Desperate people are, are stealing radiators, uh, uh, catalytic converters, anything they can get their hands on. Domestic violence is increasing. We have thousands of families that are not going to be able to feed their children after the unemployment runs off. So it's a very difficult situation. I have to admit, I certainly don't envy you. Uh, which gets me to the second subject. Uh, people in the county blame the county government for lack of jobs and the problems. <laughs> and I'm really concerned about your safety and the safety of all county employees, not only in this building, but in the field uh, because of past relations. Um, I've mentioned on a couple occasions in the past that I've been a recipient of death threats when Voigt and, and Harpo were county commissioners. Uh, three serious death threats and a couple more against my property. Who, uh, uh, Because I said they were totally useless and we needed enough jobs to meet the needs of people now living in Jefferson County. And of course for, for a Democrat to say we need jobs is contrary to, to the new Democrats who believe in Agenda 21. We need to get people out of the county and into the cities at least. Uh, also, since I rotated around the county and I talked to people, uh, in a couple of occasions uh, there have been death threats against county, uh, against county commissioners. Once in Quilcene, I was talking to a guy at Quilcene days and he became very agitated. He was, you know, shabbily dressed, uh, sports coat on, and he proceeded to tell me that if somebody offed uh, Voight, they'd be doing the county a favor. And I was so shook up, I talked to, to Prosecutor Dosell and we were unable to determine who it was, but he didn't actually break the law because he didn't say he was going to. Another time, in, uh, in, in uh, Hadlock days, I was talking to a guy and, uh, about county politics, and he said, well, he said, I just received a clean bill of health, but if he found out he's incurable cancer, he'd take a shotgun down and solve the county's uh, political problems once and for all. Now, I throw these things out because this is during good times. Now, with, with all these financial problems, uh, the, 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 the danger gets even worse. Uh, I agree with Scott Rosecrans that we need to tighten up security really severely in the, in the courthouse and for county employees around the county. Thanks. Thanks, Mr. Fritz.